Quest is uh, investing heavily in precision medicine services. Now we have great technical expertise that allows us to do gene sequencing and enable these new technologies to deliver precision medicine. But what we really bring to the table is the ability to take that information and deliver it to the community of physicians and patients around the U.S. who need it most. And we deliver that with our footprint of patient service centers, our healthcare IT connections to all the providers, um, and our sales force, our medical organization that really helps deliver precision medicine to the community. And I'm not talking about an academic medical center, although we serve them too, but I'm talking about where healthcare really happens in this country, out in community uh, physician offices. So we're really able to take what is complex, what is clinically meaningful, and deliver it in, a, um, in an effective way to the doctors and patients who need it around the country. Precision medicine has many definitions. The one I like most is that um, it's the practice in medicine of using all available data to ensure that an individual gets the most effective therapy for them. And that data includes the data from the individual. It may include genomic data from the individual, but it also includes data from other sources um, like databases, population health uh, data. Um, to really target effective therapies to the right person at the right time. Precision medicine is extremely important because we know of a lot of effective therapies in cancer, in HIV, in other fields, but those effective therapies are not always delivered to the right person who actually needs it at the right time. So if you're thinking about making a, a big impact on uh, the practice of medicine, Making sure that the right person receives the right treatment at the right time has huge value. And unfortunately now in our healthcare system, um, that, that's not practiced uh, commonly. So there's a big opportunity to improve healthcare by practicing precision medicine. One of the focus areas for Quest and precision medicine has been making the use of our big data to improve the value of our genomic services and our precision medicine services. And simply put, we have a lot of data. And if we share that data with other groups, we're able to put it together to learn more about what a mutation may mean in cancer uh, that may impact the way therapies are given to an individual patient. We've been able to share data successfully with IBM Watson and Memorial Sloan Kettering to improve the way we uh, assess mutations in cancer. Precision medicine is very much about ensuring that the right therapies are delivered to the right patient at the right time. And therefore, we have been partnering very actively with the pharmaceutical industry in precision medicine. And it's a great partnership because the pharmaceutical industry is constantly trying to develop new therapies that will improve outcomes in individuals. At the same time, uh, those therapies need precision diagnostics that will identify the right patients for the right therapy at the right time. And in these partnerships with the, with the pharma companies, we're able to improve the implementation of companion diagnostics or precision diagnostics across the United States based on our footprint and our services. And that, um, you know, when the drug's available, that's one thing, but getting that drug effectively used in the right patient at the right time requires diagnostic information services, and it's really been a great partnership that we've forged with the pharmaceutical industry to accelerate the development but also accelerate the implementation of precision medicine around new therapies. So we've made a major investment over the last couple of years in our quantum tool set, which includes population health analytics, physician-facing healthcare IT tools, and patient-facing healthcare IT tools. And I'm gonna tell you that that is as much a part of precision medicine as the next generation sequencing technologies. We have to effectively communicate the results 
to the physicians and patients and engage them in their own care. One of the critical aspects of precision medicine and really having an impact on healthcare is delivering that information effectively to the common community providers that are out there in the United States who may not be at an academic medical center and may not have access to the latest information around precision medicine. We're really well positioned to do that given that we integrate with every make and model of EMR. We service half of the physicians and half of the hospitals in the United States and have relationships with many more. And so I really see part of the quest value proposition in precision medicine in having that reach to really deliver these complex um, genomic testing results in an actionable way to the medical community across the United States who are hungry for this and who can really have an impact on patient care. Over 70% of the people with cancer in the United States are treated in a community cancer center and not in a uh, tertiary referral or a, you know, a major academic cancer center. So that's where medicine is being practiced in the United States and we really have an opportunity to bring precision medicine to the medical community around the U.S.